Welcome to the next step tutorial. In this session, we are going to discuss about dpkg command in Debian distributions. dpkg command is a command and utility to install software packages on Debian based distributions like Ubuntu and Linux Mint. dpkg command will allow you to install software packages only. You can't able to install the dependencies for your software package by using dpkg command you can use apt-get command instead to install all the dependencies for the software package now let's see some examples for dpkg command first of all i will show you how to install a package by using dpkg command now here you can see i have a package called teamweaver which is in .deb format this is a debian package now here we are going to install this package by using dpkg command for that type dpkg space hyphen i for installing space package name and hit enter now the package is installing now is completed let's verify the package is installed or not for that type the command dpkg space l space and the package name team viewer and hit enter here you can see the package is installed you can use another command to verify about the package dpkg space l space type symbol space grep space package name and hit enter by running this command dpkg space hyphen l with the package name it will receive the information for the specified package only if you want to list for all the package installed in your system means you can simply type dpkg space hyphen l and hit enter now it will list you all the packages is installed in your system to remove or uninstall a package, run the following command dpkg space hyphen r to remove and space package name. Now let's uninstall the teamweaver package. So type teamweaver and hit enter. Now the package is removed. Now I want to view the content of this teamweaver package. So now run the following command dpkg space hyphen c space package name and hit enter. Now it will list you all the content inside the teamweaver package. Here are the contents available for teamweaver package. Now let's check for a package is installed or not. Now run the following command dpkg space hyphen s space package name and hit enter here are the status for teamweaver package currently the package is not installed because we have removed it early now let's install teamweaver package again dpkg space hyphen i space package name and hit enter now let's run the same command to check for the package is installed or not now hit enter here you can see now the status is changed now the package is installed now here you can see here I have two packages is located in the slash deb directory now I want to Install all the packages inside this directory in a single command. For that, run the following command dpkg space hyphen capital R space hyphen hyphen install space slash deb. Now, this command will install all the packages located under this directory. Now, hit enter. Now, the packages is installing. Now these two packages is installed. 
Now run the following command to unpack a package manually dpkg space hyphen hyphen unpack space under the package name now hit enter now the package will be unpacked after unpacking a package run the following command to configure the package dpkg space hyphen hyphen configure space package name and hit enter now the package is configured now run the following command to uninstall a package along with its configuration file dpkg space hyphen capital P space package name team viewer and hit enter now the package team viewer is uninstalled along with its configuration file now run the following command dpkg space hyphen hyphen print hyphen architecture and hit enter this command will show you the architecture for your dpkg command now run the following command dpkg space hyphen hyphen forget hyphen old hyphen run a while and hit enter this command will clean up all uninstalled packages you can also type dpkg space hyphen hyphen clear hyphen a while to clean up the information for uninstalled packages now hit enter to check the version for dpkg command type dpkg space hyphen hyphen version and hit enter now it will show you the version to get help for dpkg command type dpkg hyphen hyphen help and hit enter or else you can open the manual page by typing a command man space dpkg hit enter here you can study about dpkg command now press q for quit so that's all about for this tutorial hope this video is helpful for you thank you for watching